Hey guys, welcome to our brand new course, Quick JavaScript Crash Course on Modern and Advanced JavaScript Hacks, where you will learn some really important JavaScript concepts and hacks to eliminate your fear of coding and improve your JavaScript coding skills. JavaScript is a language of love and hate too. Can you believe this? There are two extremes. People either love JavaScript or hate JavaScript. Love? Why not? It runs everywhere, on servers, on browsers, in mobile apps, everywhere. Not only runs, but carry a lot of cool features with cool, nice, and simple syntax. Then why hate? JavaScript is an ever-evolving language. It can surprise you by its weird behavior sometimes. You might sometimes get stuck with an issue that you have never identified or never could imagine. That's why big companies like Microsoft worked on a wrapper language like TypeScript to avoid such weird issues. JavaScript is based for many of the other languages. If you know JavaScript, you can work with a lot of other languages and dependent frameworks easily. In this course of JavaScript, we are going to discuss some latest hacks introduced recently in the language and a few of the things you should take care and avoid during programming JavaScript. And believe me, if you hate it already, you will start falling in love with this language. And if you love it, you'll start loving it even more. This may be a quick course, but it can add a lot of value to your existing JavaScript skill set. Existing? Yes, this course expects you to know JavaScript a little bit. If not, you should know at least one programming language. So what's that we are going to cover in this quick course? This course is based on newer features that got released with ECMAScript specification 6 and above. So we will only discuss things from ES6 and above. In first section of this course, we will be resolving all your doubts regarding the course. We will touch base the JavaScript history and we will get in place all the required stuff that you should have in your machine for this course. And then we will get started. In second section of the course, we will focus on variables and scoping and things to avoid and embrace around this. We will see the newer patterns to work with variables. Following that, in the third section, we will discuss about functions and arguments. This is a critical part of this course because JavaScript treats functions as first-class citizens. So knowing what changes have been incorporated in them in newer versions is also very essential. After that, in fourth section, we will discuss operators, how to better use and code them. Following this, for OOP lovers and haters both, we will discuss, I guess, the favorite topic, class enhancements and object-oriented programming. If you're not already an OOP fan yet, I believe you will at least start picturizing how object-oriented programming is helpful in making code more modular and reusable which can then motivate you to start using OOPS effectively. Then we will discuss the new functionality from error handling. An application where errors are not handled properly, the usability of such an application is near to impossible. After this, we have a section dedicated to async patterns and promises. We will see a few latest functions in comparison with similar older functions. And I'm sure you're gonna have fun learning these new functions. We will also keep adding new and interesting features in future in this course to keep this course updated with the latest launch specifications. So this is all what this course is gonna have. Please note, this is a course focused on recent JavaScript hacks. So please read prerequisites before going